The coronavirus can affect people in different ways, but shortness of breath is one common symptom. And doctor says that there is one easy way for people to monitor their oxygen levels as soon as they start feeling sick and before it's too late. WBZ's Anna Redis Rodriguez has the story. It's a tiny device that fits on your fingertip. You turn it on with one button, and it very quickly tells you your oxygen saturation as well as your pulse. It gathers information this doctor says could save lives. What we have told the people as a public health message is only go to the emergency department if you're short of breath. What we now know is shortness of breath is a late finding. There That's why Dr. Richard Levitan says out. if you're sick with the coronavirus or even feeling sick, keeping track of your oxygen levels early could help keep you out of intensive care. When we see low oxygen readings, we would bring patients in, we would treat them with oxygen and a variety of positioning maneuvers where we lay people on their stomach and we monitor their blood tests for inflammatory markers and we would reach many, many more patients earlier in the disease. The instrument is known as the pulse oximeter and can be found pretty much anywhere from pharmacies to retail stores like Walmart. They can cost as little as $25. Pulse oximeter should be in everybody's house. The same way we have thermometers, the same way people check blood pressure. His confidence comes from his experience of volunteering in New York. The emergency physician lives in northern New Hampshire, but recently spent 10 days working inside the largest public hospital in the city. The heroes in this disease, I think, are New York City frontline healthcare workers. The information they've learned, I think, is going to help America prepare for this virus in a much better way. I'm Anna Rodriguez, WBZ News.